Well, here I am, managed to wait till the killer fly. Dead. Anyway, here I am. I've managed to get into uh, Womack Island. Lovely little place. There we are. Womack Island, here I am. And uh, three boats here. Got one lady behind us. And we've got me here. We'll sit out on the veranda soon, or the back of the boat, have a bit of wine. And there's another boat there in front of me. That's a private boat by the look of it. Just go out the back here, have a little look. Still got the engine running for a little bit. It's really nice here, isn't it? It's lovely. Those of you who come here quite a lot will know that Womack Island is a very lovely place. There we are. Okay. So. This is the back of the boat. It's quite roomy. Very nice area to sit down. Got a little door here which opens if you want to get off when you stir more. <coughs> which I'll be doing tomorrow at Sail House. And if you go in here, you've got a nice large area, TV, lots of storage down there. Got uh, bow thrusters on this boat, which is really good. Makes life easy. But this boat is, is amazingly easy to turn and it's really easy to handle as well. Um, there's all my stuff there, Barnes Brinkcraft books, loads of more storage down here. Let's go down, have a look down here. This is the dining area, I mean I've still got that hamper box as you can see. Stuff on a chair there, <laughs> it's only been on my own and what a mess. Um, this is the big double berthing which goes in the bedroom here, which I don't really want in here. I might try and put it in but I don't know if I really want it in here, I think it takes up a lot of room. But we'll see. Anyway, I've made my bed up, got my frying pan there, got a few bits and pieces I just need to tidy up. So that's that. Here's a little kitchen. In the brochure it, it depicts this as, as in four um, burner, a four stove, or four elements, whatever you call it. But it's only two. A bit disappointing, but then again, it's only me on my own, so I'm not too bothered. I'm going to make bolognese on that tonight, so I want one for pasta. But I've only got enough room. You see, when you put the frying pan on there, it's too big. It will take up the whole of that space, so I can only do one thing at a time. So I'm going to have to work around that one. Nice little fridge. Uh, I mean the fridge is here. Down there. Nice little kitchen here. It's not bad. Nice as you can see where I am now, a little bit lower down. Loads of open space, some roof open. Beautiful. And the toilet. Now the only thing about this is very small. Uh, I haven't done anything in the toilet, but the water does look a little bit off colour for some reason. But it's very small. I think you pull this out for the shower. Yep, so uh, it, it, it's quite small. I mean, if I stand in here, there's my foot there. You know, I, mean, I can get, I can squeeze in here. So it's going to be a bit of a squeeze, but we'll see how we go with that. Um, and that's that, really. Let's do it up. Okay. Let's go back out. Let's have a look at the boat. Let's go outside. We climb up here. And we go down here. So, just have a lovely look around. It's beautiful and peaceful here. I tell you, it's really lovely. This is Billmore from Barnes Brinkcraft. Really nice boat, actually. I think it's, I think it's nicer than what I thought it would be. Just really easy to handle. I mean it did a 360 without any bow thrusters in a small space. It's got an amazing turning circle on it. There's the back. So yeah, it's a nice little boat. I'm quite happy with this. So, what more can I say apart from I might, uh, I might contact you later on, let you know how my bolognese has got on. <laughs> Might even do a cook show, but how can I do that when you've got our friend Jeffrey who does it on his boat called the Corsican? How can I take that away from him? He's much better than me. Okay, so there we are. That's part of the adventure today, which has been really good for Boaty Man on the River Bure, now at Womack Island. Little stop at St. Bennett's Abbey where we saw the cows going visit berserk, and one cow wasn't very well. Hmm. Well, that's it then. No more to be said. Okay, I'll see you later. Bye-bye.